Hello and welcome to this interview with one of the award winners of the Jülicher Excellence Prize 2023. That's an award for successful young scientists for doctoral researches here at the Forschungszentrum and for their outstanding research. And now I'd like to welcome Dr. Moritz Weber. Hi, Moritz. Hi. Congratulations, of course. Thank you very much. On the prize, yeah. first of all. Um, in short, what would you say? What is your doctoral thesis? What is your research about? Mm. Yeah, as we know, many societies around the globe are experiencing a, a transition of their energy system right now towards a more and more sustainable system. And for this, uh, we need a well-aligned mix of different energy technologies to support this future system. And one major component of this system is likely to be green hydrogen. And for the production of green hydrogen, we need catalysts. Catalysts are um, multifunctional electronic devices that allow to facilitate certain reactions. And in this case, this would be the splitting of water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen gas. And the hydrogen gas then can be uh, stored, transported, and converted back into electric energy when needed. Unfortunately, these kind of catalysts are made from yeah, scarce and expensive metals at the moment. And of course, we, we want to build them from more inexpensive uh, materials to make them uh, cost effective and to uh, enable the, the implementation of these technologies worldwide. Um, yeah, so in my, in my thesis, I have uh, studied the design principles for such catalysts mm -hmm. uh, that are made from oxides, so relatively inexpensive. And uh, uh, in particular, I've focused on a, a reaction mechanism that is yeah, increasingly, increasingly important, uh, which is called metal exolution. And here I have focused on uh, the fundamentals of the reaction and I was able to develop a novel understanding of the reaction mechanism. And based on these findings, I uh, defined no new uh, strategies how to control the reaction and the correlated functionality of the catalyst. You wrote uh, your thesis here at the Forschungszentrum. What would you say, what is special about doing it here in Jülich and what opportunities does uh, the Forschungszentrum offer young scientists like yeah. you? Yeah, and yeah, in, in my appearance, it's, it's indeed a very special place. Mm -hmm. um, uh, we have an excellent research infrastructure. We have a diverse and uh, multidisciplinary approach of doing research. And uh, yeah, young scientists will find some of the most advanced labs uh, around the world here, uh, state-of-the-art equipment. Um, yeah, either here directly on campus or in the extended research uh, network. Um, yeah, the, the Forschung Centrum runs its own graduate school, so you can get training in different methodological or communication skills. Um, yeah, of course, you have the, the ability to, to um, build your network and various uh, seminars, workshops, conferences. Um, so, yeah, there's a lot of good things around here. Sounds like a good environment for the research. And what happens next for you now? What, what are your plans for the future? So, yeah, I, I just came back from a one-year uh, postdoctoral uh, fellowship um, uh, at Berkeley Labs, and I'm still affiliated with the lab, but back in, in Jülich now at uh, Peter Grunberg Institute for Electronic Materials, finishing up my, my project, which were um, yeah, intensifying my studies on exolution catalysts, actually. And uh, now I'm taking the time to uh, yeah, find new orientation in my uh, personal and professional goals looking for a new um, position and I'm in contact with, with a various group that, that might be interested. Good luck for that. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks.